All right, so that was um, <clears throat> that was completely um, completely blindsided me. Yeah, that's crazy. So anyway, uh, it's Tuesday or no Monday night, and uh, we were able to get home today, so that's good. I could do the uh, you know like I said uh, I can do the next three days here like I have in the past. Blah blah blah. So you know I got home tonight and I got talking to my wife. I got thinking about it. I'm like, all right, so here's the deal. I'm still not going to necessarily associate it as, as much, but I but I do have to realize that I'm always going to have MS. It's always going to be there. Here's my belief on it. I have a genetic predisposition that allows me to develop it if the environment, if it's the right environment for the wrong thing to happen, which is ultimately the right thing for, you know, when you have a, pre-genetic disposition so and I, and I wouldn't be and I didn't think of this until I got home tonight and I kind of like jumped back into my routine and it, and it reminded me of how I got to slow down now I don't really necessarily have to not do all the things that I'm doing but I'm I'm compromised I'm not healthy and, but at the same time, I'm not discrediting what all of you go through that, that aren't even sick. And it's a lot to handle. I mean, you, you get up in the morning and you have to prepare for a full day at work and you, you're making food and you're cleaning up and you're running around and, and you have kids, one or two or three or four of them or who knows, and you got to get them ready and you're watching over them and you got to bring them to school and, and then you got to go to work and then you got to worry about all the stuff you get bombarded with at work. And then you got to pick up your kids and you're running around and you're doing this and that and the other thing. And you got to get groceries and you got to cook and clean and you got to put everything away, right? And, I mean, and, and then you get like an hour or two maybe at night where you can sit around and try to relax and be with your family. And, uh, and then you go to bed and you repeat. And there's a whole bunch of other stuff in there. But when you're compromised, you know, again, you have all of that and then you have all this extra weight and all this extra baggage and all that, that, that other thing that can happen. And, you know, so I haven't been on medication and maybe if I was on medication, maybe it would have helped prevent this from happening, but it's a, it's a, it's a big pie and there's, there's pieces of the pie and there's bigger pieces of the pie. And I'm going to reluctantly probably get back on some sort of drug. Um, even though I just do not want to do that. Um, I don't want to be on any of it. Uh, but I think my family would kill me a little bit. It would not go over well. I'm probably, I don't know. I, either way, I think, I think the routine was a bigger piece of that pie than me not being on the medication. But again, I could be wrong. I just did a video, what? three weeks ago where I was explaining how I've been getting better and I have gotten better and the improvements that I've gotten better haven't been from the drugs. I, and I, and I can, I got the information to back that up to show you. So I just got to learn from it and just do exactly what I just said and just take it. It's a big learn experience and just move on. It is what it is. It is what it is. So, but it is disappointing because this, this new lesion is in a different spot uh, that, I, that, I, that I don't have any other all in my brain and my spine. And um, this is on the brain stem. So that's why it was so different for me because I was experiencing different things that I haven't experienced in the last 20 years, basically. So, but then I got thinking tonight too, I'm like, you know, that's, that's maybe not a bad thing either because I think I have a, a fairly large lesion that's old in my spine that has basically given me all my, my lower leg extremities and my feet issues. So it's better that I have, I didn't get blasted there again because if I got blasted there again, I would have been damn near paralyzed like I've been in the past. So yeah, it's in a new spot, but maybe that's not a bad thing. And I could kind of see how, I could kind of see how, um, 
that it's in a different spot compared to where it used to be mostly because I was a lot more active and I was a lot more, uh, I was a lot harder on myself. So I can, I can kind of see maybe a possible relation there as well. So I, I guess um, it makes sense, hopefully, or I could be wrong again. That's fine. And, and, and maybe I wasn't even wrong, but I just, I needed to elaborate on some things and I needed to clarify some things and, uh, and I was going to do that anyway. Um, but, uh, one last thing right now, and, uh, that I, that I really, I think, I think what I want to start doing with these videos, because I just don't have the time. I, I think a lot of the videos that I put up, I'm going to be like live. So I'm going to ramble on, I'm going to repeat myself. Uh, they might not be as polished if I, if I did a bunch and chopped them up and put them together. But ultimately that's really how I want it to be. Cause it's just going to be easier on me. It's going to be less time and I can, I can talk to you guys more often and it, it doesn't have to be such a big deal. You know, I'm just, I want to look at this camera like you're my best friend. You're my best friend. That's, that's who I'm talking to right now. And it's easier because you can, you, you should be able to say whatever you, you, you want and you can talk about anything with your best friend, best friends and, um, you know, your loved ones, your family. And, uh, and even if they do judge you, it's okay because they're your best friends and, and they're looking out for you. So uh, that's that's really how I want this to be. It'll just be easier. I mean, I'm still going to edit videos and put them together and stuff. I'm still going to do all that. But it's just easier, especially right now, just to be able to fire them off. So um, I think that's about it for now. We'll see you later.